continue. Can't continue from last save because you, you the game remembers. I don't have to go to the men, men, uh, menu for the loading. The music's very loud for me, by the way, but it's okay because it's all of it's good. There we go. It's quiet again. Oh yes, I had to make my compute. I had to make a computer. <laughs> I didn't have to make a computer. I had to uh, format some stuff, and I did that. And now we're here. I had to get a hand, right? I have, I have, I have a hand in my inventory. A saw blade that was used for the hand. <laughs> if you had AirPods, you'd lose them 100%. I would. Well, I say that, but I, I haven't lost my my Bluetooth uh, earbuds. But they also have the little case. I mean, I know the AirPods have them too. And I'm very like put them back in the thing. Everything goes back into the proper place. But maybe that's just me. <laughs> maybe I'm just, uh, you know, what's what's the term for that? Anal. <laughs> um, okay, so uh, I got a syringe. I have a syringe. Do I even need a syringe? I have a gas mask, glow stick, a flashlight. I have 11 batteries. I can just charge that right back up. But I think the flashlight batteries go by so quickly. No, it's locked. Can I break it open? Do I have a- th I don't have a weapon in this game, I noticed that. There are no weapons in this game for me. It's very strange, because I'm so used to having a weapon. A bucket's a weapon. <laughs> there we go. I'm happy that they give me this this choice. Bottle of vis visse? Solminus or whatever it said? I'm very happy that they give you this option. It's like, oh no, it's locked. We need a key. Break it. That's my that's how I live my life. <laughs> In horror games, I'm like, oh, I was like, just break it. Just break down the door, you know what? Either it's hardly been used or it's been well cleaned. I'm no expert, but there's some strange spots on the spinal x-ray. Over there. Looks like a paper clip right here. Hmm. I am doctor now. Did I go? Did I already see this computer terminal? No, I went to it. Okay, so I haven't read any of these things. So I could start off on 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 this. That's right. We spoke to that person. That we don't have a video feed. She's on there though. What was her name? I forgot her name. She's talking to us and she's uh, hiding somewhere and she I said she's all like, I want your help, but also kind of not at the same time. Well, I don't know. Uh, but she spoke to us and then I still have these patient reports. So I'm gonna go ahead and read those. Files corrupt, could not open. Never mind. Crip chemical tests? There we go. Subject primate chimpanzee. Chemical timazepan? As expected, there's the subject displays symptoms of relaxation and lethargy. Uh, chemical lysergic acid divalmanide. Much akin to previous work with felines, the chimpanzee shows no ability to cope with the chemical stimulant. Uh, oh, this is the thing! Visse somnus. Following injection, the subject's heart rate slows to such a rate that, for all intents and purposes, it appears dead. In truth, heart rate has dropped to, incredibly, a safe level, and the subject rec recovers soon after. Te Tetrahydrocannabinol. This chemical is held to be entirely safe in moderation and produces a relaxation effect in the subject. It remains to be seen whether long-term exposure leads to mental health risks. The primate is worn out. Please consider this an official requ requ requisition order for further test subjects for the mainland. <laughs> I'm sure you're gonna test everything out on, the, on this, this poor primate? Oh my god, I'm exhausted. Carol looks like he's been on Skooma uh, years on the first game. I've seen, I've seen the clips whenever I, whenever I bought and downloaded the game, like, oh my. <laughs> old game is old, old game is old. Always remind myself, old game is old, you know? You it's not, it's not fair to compare. But we do it anyways, don't we? We don't, we do, we do, we do, we do. <laughs> okay, do I need to touch this, the thingy again? Oop. It's an old artifact. It is, but let's, oh wait, did I look a bit? Uh, no. Okay. Just making sure. That's right, I just got here. I just got here. There's a TV set. I came in from somewhere. 
open the drawers. There's blood on the wall. That's normal. That's that's a normal ba bathroom for you. Here's a brick. Do I need this for something? I don't think so. <laughs> it's just the lights. Oops. Okay, maybe this is where I came from. <laughs> no TP. Is that why it's on the wall? <laughs> is, that, is that why it's smeared on the wall? I think I came from here. I think I was running from a monster and I was like, ah, 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 it's going to kill me. It's going to kill me. It's going to kill me. And then I ran in here. I think that's what it was. Jot down a note just in case. What? What's your note? To do list. Uh, the door to a cryo chamber is in infirmary is locked. Can I break it? <laughs> True horror. No toilet paper in the bathroom. Can I break it? I'm gonna see. <laughs> That's a no. I'm gonna try again. Hold on. The door actually wiggles. Wow. It's aware of me trying to, uh attack it but it's like no that's a no for me fair enough Ooh, what's this is that a watch no pick it up emergency wristband oh that's right they had wristbands a wristband with a small box on it wonder what could what use it could have do i have to have it on my person or equip it or, or? oh there you go i put it on <laughs> so you work now nope okay Wait, hold on, there's a switch back here. Nothing. Okay. <gasps> oh my- oh, 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 I see you, I see you, I see you. I got you. <laughs> I have four now. They gave me collectibles, how dare they? <laughs> how dare they know what I need in my life is collectibles. <laughs> Spotted it. Flashlight. I would love to keep using the flashlight, but the fact that the batteries wear it out makes me very sad. Okay. Um. Wait. No. So I went into there, but I actually have the ability to go to the library. Infirmary. There is a creature out here somewhere. Somewhere. Oh, wait, a retinal scanner? How's this gonna work? Oh no, I need something for the eye scanner. And now I just have a hand in my inventory. Okay. Um. No. Oh. Maybe that's why I'm in, I'm in the <clears throat> excuse me. Maybe that's why I'm in I'm in the infirmary to get an eyeball. Where or where can I get an eyeball? I didn't realize I had a retinal scan too. I just saw the palm print one. Okay, so I guess I go back to the infirmary and try to find a way around. What choice do I have? Oh, what about the canteen? Can't. <laughs> what about the canteen? Can't. Team. Into the canteen. Okay, what can I do here? Okay. Oh, the screen reads, non-human sample. Insert new sample and try again. I'm non-human? Is it because I've touched the artifact too many times? I'm no longer a human. <laughs> Damn it. Raiden needs to find an enemy soldier for the retinal scanner again. <laughs> I'm not human anymore. I bet just because I touched the, um... Artifact. <laughs> I was just trying to remember what the word, like, uh, uh, I just said it. I don't know if it's like when you're in contact of the artifact. I mean, I've touched it all the time because I'm like, hoo hoo, it gives me an auto save. Which is probably what, not what they wanted me to do. Can 
There's a wire here going up. It says cryo chamber. Let me in. Bet you there's a cool eyeball in there I need. Oh, <laughs> that's how fast the flashlight burns out. Jeez, what's the point of you then? Okay, why can't I turn off the light? What is the reason? Hmm. Can't read that. I can't read. Bucket? Do you need a bucket for something? No. Hmm. Nothing. How come this does nothing? There's like all these uh, lines on the wall, so it makes me think there's something to do with that. Maybe I just need to look around some more. Maybe I don't, maybe I don't have all the information yet. Did you ever think about that? That you don't have all the information? Because that's what I'm thinking. on. I'm working on something here. I'm working on- There. <laughs> well, that didn't help me, and now it's partially through the floor. <laughs> okay, let's go look around some more. Um, I feel like I've already been everywhere but the library and here. Not even the dirty mattress can trigger an alarm. I know. <laughs> that mattress, maybe maybe it'll let the mattress in and then I can just, you know, zoom by with it. Guess not. Uh, this map is relatively useless to me because it's. I, my, I see the signs. Can't go into the cantina though. Wait. Does it say, wait, could I always come in here? Don't think it has any power. Okay, this is the room that I first came into here. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, 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 I remember this, I remember this. Yeah, there's the sewers! What up, what, what's up, sewers? I think I can go, can do without going back into the sewers. Me too, but you know, the next game happens and then I'm in the sewers again, so... <laughs> you just end up in the sewers each time. Can't get in there. It's the library. I need an eyeball. Mm. I feel like I've already been everywhere though. Like what more do you want from me, game? Wait, have I been in here? Oh. I don't think I've been in here before. Oh, okay. That, I'm cool with that. If it's new, I'll, I'll go into it. Okay, but now now I got nothing. Oh, this is where the creature was before. Speaker. Okay. So I got something. Wait, that, does that mean I've been- Have I been to storage? I think I've been to storage. I think this is the first place I went into. Yes, I remember this now. And the laser beams are off. Yeah. yeah, and the spiders came out because the voice in my head is like tee hee. That's where I got the gas mask. Okay. No more skittering. Oh my god. Trying to bother me with the skittering. There are no more spiders. They totally put that in the in the game to, to mess with me. I think the spider's really bugged. Um, <laughs> the spider's really bugged. They're not bugs. Uh, really bugged Philip. And so, the voice in my head is all like, hey, you didn't like the spiders? Well, here's a, f a fake one. <laughs> okay, let's try over here now. 
machine room. Let's try in the machine room, see if there's anything I can find. I know I got- I had the gas mask for this area. Won't budge. I filtered out the gas, which is I guess what I needed to do, but now what? Burning rubber. I really hate that smell. It is an awful smell, agreed. Uh, but is there something back here that I need? There's a machine in here, too. There's this pit that has heat down there, if I remember. I opened up this. What am I missing? There's another artifact. Apparently I can turn on the computer, but I can't look at it. Okay, that's fair. That's right, this is where I went through before. It's not working any properly anymore. I think I've already been over there. So now it's broken down so I can't go in. Game time. Forget the rest of the game. Let's play a video game on the computer. <laughs> it's just like real life. A game within a game. Who's this? Is this where, where some, some poisonous gas is coming out of? The immersion of a game within a game. Okay, so we're done with the machine room. Wait. Did I see you before? Wait, can I take out your eyeball? Hey, can I have your eyes? <laughs> That's a weird thing to say. Um, seven. Oh, come on, just saw, saw off his head. Just a little, just a little snip. And take take his eyeball. Um, what a hand! I need to get thinking straight. Oh come on, that's a perfectly good body right here. Nope. A perfectly good body right here with a perfectly good eyeball. What was the vi vis vis visque somnus? What was this again? You need the super specific tool to remove his eyeballs. Of course, of course, I should have known. Hold on, let me look at my notes. Uh, uh -huh. uh, slows to such a rate that for all intents and purposes it appears dead. In truth, heart rate has dropped to an incredibly safe level and the subject would recover soon after. Oh, oh, I can use this. I can use, oh, I can use this. Okay, so put this in. Bloop. Fill the syringe with the substance from the chemical jar. Cool. And does that mean I need to get find somebody? Inject them with it. Drag them to the thingy. Use their eyeball. Which I was thinking too because um, I don't know if the, this game follows that rule, but it's like, wasn't it like a dead, a dead eye? It just goes glassy. Like it won't pick up anything. It just fogs over or something of that sort. So I'm like, just taking out an eyeball is not really gonna help much. I'm pretty sure the person has to still be alive. Um, computer? Do, is, is it the monster? Do I need to stab the monster with the syringe? I don't know, that seems like a bad idea. I'm gonna try, I'm gonna try it. There's an autosave if I die. <laughs> it's okay. <laughs> I'm just gonna bring this out. Wait. Not injecting. What, what did you say? Hold on. Not injecting myself with this out here. I need to be at a safer location to. Wait, I need to use it on myself? I'm not going to let that thing out again. He says no. <laughs> Philip says no. Okay, so I have to use that, this to inject it on myself then. Okay. How do I how do I do this? Okay. I have I have pieces here. <laughs> the monster banging on the door on the other side. It's like, yeah, that's frightening. I don't like this. I don't like this. I don't like this one bit. Uh what if I Inject myself in the infirmary and then magically get put through the cryo thingy. 
by some weird chance. I don't know. Trying things. Good thing this is a video game because if this was real life, like, you know, I end up killing myself by accident. <laughs> like, oopsies! That's not what I should have done. Okay. Do I eject myself here? And I'm ejected. Now what? Oh, because I'm, I'm not... I don't know what I'm supposed to be doing. Oh! Uh, uh, was this a good idea? <laughs> oh, the whispers. <gasps> Wait, the door's green now. For a moment there, I really thought that might have been curtains. Wait, why is the door green now? <clears throat> why is it fine now? I don't understand. I'm taking these. <laughs> okay, I guess. I guess that's okay to do. A cryogenic freezer. I don't know how that changed anything. Is it just because it's like, I'm not me anymore or something? A small cryo chamber. Is there a head in there? The whispers tell us 999 by now. <laughs> oh, now the door's red. Cryogenic freezer. I wonder if there's anything in there. Maybe I'm better off not knowing. Maybe. Stop with the creepy sounds. The meter reads. Minus 200 degrees Celsius. That's cold even for this place. Oh! There it is! You're what I need. Come on, get, come on, come on, come on. Thank you! Okay. <laughs> oh no, is the door not okay? I was gonna say is the door not openable anymore? Never mind, it is. Okay, so that did a thing. Did it quite by accident. Got 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 a little got ahead in life. Just a little bit. Now I can use this on the library door. I don't quite understand why the door suddenly becomes unlocked after that. It was like a Stretch Armstrong toy. It was. <laughs> it was like that. I don't know if the game shook or if I shook. Okay, now I'm just going in a circle and there's like a menacing noise going on in the background somewhere and I don't like it. How peculiar. Yeah. I could have sworn we remembered there being a door here before. How queer. What's in that direction? Oh, silly old me. I haven't got any hands to point with, have I? Stop messing with my brain. I know there's a door here. I'm just gonna shove it against the wall somewhere. <laughs> just because my brain cannot perceive the door does not mean the door does not exist. Oh, voice in my head who is messing with me. Man, okay, fine. Where do you want me to go? I'm gonna follow you into this mess in my brain. No, not that way. You sure you know where we're going? Didn't we pass the door just back there? You see? You silly Billy. It was here all along. Would you like Uncle Clarence to take the steering wheel for a while? <laughs> you should see your face. <laughs> this is actually gonna be fun. Perhaps I won't get you killed after all. 
I want you to do both of them. Okay. There we go. No messing with me. <laughs> I picked up some baggage on the way, but finally I was close to my goal. Some baggage on the way? I mean, yes, but also a hand and a head now. Are they are they just like in your back pocket? But finally I was close to my goal. I was sure answers lay behind the, that door. They were answers I should have set out to find when I received my father's letter in 2000. Why did I wait a whole year to come here? Oh, this is different. Books. Got so many books. Oddly enough, it's a whole section of detective novels. Fun. De Vermis Mysterious. They really got a bunch of strange books here. The Necronomicon. <laughs> or whatever. <gasps> I see you and I need you. How do I get you? Ooh, a note. I can't read it. Oh, hey, man. I can read this. Guess your old buddy Clarence comes through for you again, the monkey. Do you want to know what it says? Do you? I do. do. How dare I'll you? Bet you do. You're just going to be lying to me. <laughs> I say, can you feel a draft? Is that what you're going to tell me? Okay. <clears throat> Look, Mr. Head, books! Pencils. You don't pick the hint, do you? Why don't you set that investigative brain of yours to on for a change? How about a good read? It, what? Is it in my inventory? I don't know where it is. Do you want me to read the thing? Where, where did you put the thing? Grab a paper. Well, I'm not done looking around anyways, so. Physics and maths. Ew. <laughs> the things I'm not good at. <sighs> but I want the statue, though. For all the crappy, cliche films you got bundled up in here, you sure don't recognize a classic mechanic when you see one. Is it the book on a on a thing, and then I can open it, and it's like, oh no, there's a mysterious wall behind it. Well, that's fine and well and good, but I have a thing I need to get. How do I get there? Some well thumb linguistics books. Cool. Oh yeah, clock. Okay, but how do I get up? Fine, I'll do the thing you want me to do. These look very simple. Is it the this? No. Is it this? No. Is it the artifact? Whoa. The turn gate. These belong to them. I feel less here. I'm slipping. I believe There's you a are. Big book in the bloody bookcase. I they know this. Words in the middle. Do you even want to get out of here? <laughs> I know this, but do you see these books? They all look the same, and I can't tell the difference. Nature. I just have to scan through, but I want the, the statue up top, though, and I don't know how to get to it. Cryogenics for dummies. That makes one thing <laughs> that makes one thing make more sense down here. That is hilarious. <laughs> okay. Oh no, that's just the polygons going through. Okay. I'm like, what is that? Never mind. It's nothing. All I'm thinking about is that statue. You you realize that, right? That's all I'm thinking about is the statue up top that I really want to get. I'm trying to, like, figure out how to get to it. Because all of these are, like, a little bit too tall for me to jump on top of. 
Oh, I hear it. I hear the um, the wind. But, um, the statue, though? How do I get it? Man. Oh, there's some boxes in here. I'll take them with me. Ah! Oh my god! He's dead! Quick! If he hasn't started this <laughs> spell, give him the kiss of life. Yeah, I was about to say, that's your dad. <clears throat> Throw the head at it. <clears throat> Howard, father, I... Somehow I knew it would end this way. Why did it? Why, not, why did I come? Why did you come here? Closure? This is not worth closure, man. I'm sorry. <clears throat> Ugh. Give it a second. This is some nice music here. <clears throat> Turing Gate via Sentient's conclusions. Howard Lafresque. Since leaving the last bastion of humanity in this place behind, it has become clear that my faith was well placed, my conclusions were correct, and it is only that which has brought me this far. It has taken me some time to make my way through the infected area of the shelter, and with the observations I have made, my prior discovery seems all the more obvious and vital. The infected humans communicate with one another. Similar, if uh, simpler, communication is observed in in infected creatures of all species. At times, the infected seem to coordinate without clear line of sight. Te telepathy. Despite a ca catatonic appearance, the infected are quite capable of high-level brain functions. Their problem-solving abilities at times seem to far outstrip those of a healthy human being. When separated, the creature lose this intelligence, indicating some form of communal or central intelligence. Conclusion. The intelligence displayed is of such a level that we can only assume the communal mind is also rational. It is this conclusion that has formed the backbone of my recent endeavors. Though the infected may wander around like mindless, for what of a better word, or want of a better word, zombies, they are no more stupid than a worker bee. <laughs> Automatons. Automatons. Automatons, that's the word. Yes, but far from stupid. In short, I believe the central intelligence might somehow be communicated with, bargained with. Communication, however, is most likely impossible once infected, unless there was a way to subdue the infection for long enough to contact the hive. There must be a way to find peace. Today I communed with the Turngate mind. I was correct. It is intelligent beyond our wildest imagination. It told me everything, everything I needed to know. You could not imagine it. I cannot accept it. God forgive us. Okay. Oh, diddums. Daddy popped his clogs. Bull bleeding who? Get on with it, will ya? <laughs> Give me a moment. That's my dad. I need to cry. Or something. I don't know. Did he ever know his father? Does Philip ever know his father? Just know of him? Probably. Boxes. Okay, okay, I'm gonna get that. I'm gonna get that that little statue thing game. Hold on. It's imperative that I do. <laughs> Dad was also a lore collector. I know, I'm impressed. I'm growing up just to be like him. <laughs> Collecting all the lore. His lore. New lore. Fo follow in my father's footsteps. <laughs> so did he just like stay in here and starve himself to death or something? Like rough? Or does he have a gun or something? Rough. <laughs> like, if he has a gun, can I take it? <laughs> to fight against the monsters? No, 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 no. Okay, hold on. <laughs> yes! Give me! Yes! Okay, now we can go through the door. <laughs> hold on, let me, t let me touch the thing again. <laughs> this can't be good, the fact that I can't be using it. May never get used to that. I don't think we're ever gonna be able to be, um, fine again. I barely even thought about my father's death. I guess I wasn't expecting to find any other find him any other way. I was determined to complete his work, find an answer to the infection, and then contact the hive. Ooh. 
Why would you want that? Seriously, closure is not worth this. <laughs> but that's my opinion, you know. To each their own. I, say, I feel like I'm crouching. No, it's just really large. It's an old concrete pipe, probably used in the sewer. It's a large wooden board. Whoa. No rumble. Something feels very ominous right now, or is that just me? <laughs> very ominous. No lore inside the tube, not this time. Hmm. Quite heavy. Let's see. Get over here. I don't know if I'll be able to reach that. I'll try. Hmm. Let's see, let's see, let's see. take these. You can't make it into a ramp. Oh, what was the button? C? Oh, there's a thing here. Hold on. Never mind. <laughs> well, that just makes it easier. <laughs> Quite heavy. And now he lifts it in the air like it was a piece of paper. With one hand, no less, because the other hand's holding the glow stick. Remember this. Here I thought I had to find a way to, to make it to the top and then bring down the ladder. No, there was a lever. Who'd have thought? Okay, climb, climb it. And now I'm climbing a ladder with one hand. Impressive. Okay, let's not move this down. There we go. Keep going, keep going, keep going. He just walks the ladder up. <laughs> it's really heavy, but I think I can move it. Yeah, we just did. And here we are. Whoa. Holy hell! Um, I, I mean, good! <laughs> yeah! Uh, more monkeys for the incinerator. Shut up! His throat is practically gone. Poor guy looks like a nasty death. Just stick the body. Oh, the ladder is a bit broken here. <gasps> a statue! Oh no, I want it! Oh, oh! Ah! My ankles. <laughs> I panicked. <laughs> There's a statue there! I need it! 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 Okay. Yeah, haha! -ha. Mine! <laughs> How many do I have? Six. <laughs> It was imperative that I get the statue. Okay, so how do I get up all the way? Oh! Oh, I see. Never mind. I'm glad that rock didn't fall on me. Can I knock it over? Oh, there we go. It really is quite amazing. You monkeys and your problem solving. How do you manage it with such small, singular brains? Isn't it terribly quiet not hearing the thoughts of every one of your brothers? It would certainly help out if we could. Just saying. But remember, it's not the size of your brain. Excuse me, mattress. Incoming video chat. You came. I guess I didn't really expect you to bother. My lab partner's such a pessimist. Was such a pessimist. It kind of rubbed off on me. He tried to make it through to me not too long ago. I guess he's a bit late for the party. You'll have to make a quick detour over the surface next, but be careful. If the cold doesn't kill you, well, 
Let's just say I didn't pick the safest of locales for my last ditch survival attempt. Okay, good news. Um, good news, good news. Oh yeah, I think I've got a cure. <laughs> well, it's not really what you'd call a cure-cure, but it should be enough to help you. I don't think I'm infected. I was careful, but I guess if you come rescue me and I'm looking at you like you're a roast chicken, I got it wrong. Sorry, that probably wasn't funny, was it? No, I suppose not. Well, I hope to see you soon. Yeah, yeah, cures, rescues, saving the world, all so cliché, all so ridiculous. Do you really think you're doing the right thing? <laughs> Your morality is just a lasting stain left behind by religion. Burn. <laughs> Amabel fixed her damn camera, I know. Which I think is definitely on purpose. Fog crept, could not open. Man, but more lore. I'm denied my lore. I don't know why I just moved the boxes there. You know, just... Chaos. <laughs> A cure! I had my doubts by then, but I didn't have much choice. I resolved to find Amabel and put things to right. Or put things right. Oh no, we're in the cold. Why? Oh, I'm not actually cold, you understand? I'm just trying to make you feel better. Huh. Very inefficient thing, your brain. Gives off lots of heat. Uh, uh, uh. Spray with flammable content? Um, nope. Hold on, stop, stop. <laughs> no, it's jumping the dub. Okay, okay, okay. Oh no, I'm hurt. Stop being hurt. Oh no, okay, I'm, I'm fine. It's just it hurts for a second. Gotcha. Okay, what about was it four? And a flare, maybe? Huh? No, I'm trying to use the, the thing with it. Huh, yeah, maybe I could just manufacture your way out of here or not. I'm trying to help you, man. Put it in the tub, then. How about that? Okay. I know, I'm trying to put the flare in there. It's really hard for me to use the flare. I'm gonna die. Into the barrel. In into the barrel, please. Into the bar barrel. It's hovering above the barrel. <laughs> Why isn't this working? What am I missing? Okay, before I die, let's see if I can find any other information. Back into the building, back into the building. I need some worth, I need to heal. No! Man. It's a perfectly good flare right here. It doesn't wanna. It doesn't, it doesn't wanna. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die! This thing's frozen. Okay, well, you know what? Let's just take this time to look around with some more. And maybe once I die. Oh. Okay, continue. <laughs> maybe once I die, I can look around better. Okay, let's start over here. Quickly, quickly now. Oh, I'm not actually cold, you understand? No. Dark sticky material. Lighter! This blare has lighter fluid in it. At least it could get you get now, a fire if gotcha. I were you, which arguably I am, I'd be asking myself oh. in a gormless sort of voice. <laughs> Did that bridge really collapse? Or is my good friend Clarence just playing an hilarious jig? Oh, you're definitely playing a the hilarious jig. Monkey man is that I don't even know myself. One way to find out. Please, don't get us killed. I thought that's what you want me to do. I 
thought your entire goal was to, to make me suffer. <laughs> okay. Oh, there's a thing over there. Okay, let me go heat myself up again. Hold on. Okay, at least I have a lighter now. I need to get back to that little shelter. Light up that barrel so I can heat up again and then go towards the machine with the, with the spray. I understand that much. Stop that. No. <sighs> Run! Okay, that was much easier than trying to make a, a, a thing across the way. Okay, there we go. Parkour! <laughs> when I was a kid, we... Hold a lighter to an aerosol and go torch some insects. Of course, I'm beyond that sort of thing nowadays. We can still use it as a torch. Just see here for a second. Oh boy. It's like, okay, voice in my head. It's like, is the, is the bridge collapsed? Like, you know what? It doesn't matter. I'm gonna find my way around. I'm gonna parkour across. <laughs> Count on that. Okay, Let's go back in for some heat. There's a bridge out. Oh, close enough. Woo! Hmm, this charrette. He's plastered all over your mind like a garish wallpaper. Hey. He wanted to die and... <laughs> we wouldn't let him. <laughs> you know, he's kind of humming up the place, if you know what I mean. Weird smell. No, don't you dare get rid of my memory of Red. Give you a memory of him he was my BFF. Even though I, I was very distrustful of him too at the same time. <laughs> don't you dare. Don't you dare get rid of my memories of Red. What did I pick up, by the way? A uh, dirty cloth. Okay. okay. There's some boxes in here. Just looking around, looking around. Hold on, hold on. Nope, 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 nope. Okay, down here, down here. Uh, won't remove it by hand. Not quite right. Yeah, about five. <laughs> Stay here. Oh. Oh, okay. Six. Oh, okay. I get it. I get it. I get it. I get it. Okay. Light it. Oh, okay. Let me go get some more worms. <laughs> uh, okay. I, oh, I forgot because the flashing on my screen, I don't think OBS picks it up completely. I think it kind of smooths it out. So it's probably like a brief moment of an image. I have to look. I'm most focused on the game so I don't see it. But uh, I realized that last stream that the screen shakes on mine, it, like, it flickers of, of various images, and I don't think OBS picks it up. A shovel would be more useful than blowing it up, I know, but we don't have a shovel, so blowing it up is our only answer. Close enough? Oops, I keep putting on the thing. Huh? Huh? No. Closer? There we go. Oh, oh, it did it automatically. Okay, well. Okay. Okay, I'll soak it in some flammable thing. Okay, 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 we're going we're going back to the thing. Uh, damn it, I keep putting that on. This isn't Metro. <laughs> what do I 
you to soak, soak it. Oh, alcohol. I have alcohol. That should work a little bit. Doesn't alcohol freeze really fast if it's like in the cold? Sweet warmth. I think we'll be indoors now. Finally. Oh god. Okay. <laughs> As I said, I think my screen flickers, but I don't think OBS picks it up. I think it's just like maybe like a translucent image on top. Okay. But it's actually flickering so, on my screen. On the to-do list. Find this damsel in distress. Kill the bad guys. Cure infection. Save the world. Chances of success? Nil. Chances of survival? Well, you got old Clarence on board. That should speak for itself. Chances of you buggering things up royally? Almost certain. I mean, yes, but also no. <laughs> Where is the tiny- We don't have any weapons this time. Makes me very sad. <laughs> I agree. I miss my tiny hammer, my crowbar. I miss all my things. I don't get any weapons this one. Ooh. Oh. Oh. The shelter. This place is huge! Okay, so where am I? I am... Where am I? Am I at four? No, that's the kennel. Huh. Science wing A. South exit. Okay, this must be where I am. So I'm in the foyer. To the right. Blue, 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 blue. To research facility. It's straight away. Yeah. Cool. Oh, someone tried to block this up. I'd say it's a definite dead end. <laughs> I say that too. Hello? Mm. <laughs> There's a reason why it's being blocked off. Why is this chair here? Mm. Oh. Holes in the glass. That's not good. That's never a good sign. You know, yeah. you turning up here is probably the second best thing to happen to me since I've been down here. I'm reserving first place for when we get out. So, I'm not big-headed enough to think you came all the way here just to rescue me. I wasn't lying, though. I think I've worked out how to disinfect you. But, you probably saw this coming. It's not quite as simple as all that. I had to engage the failsafe on the research rooms to seal myself in here. And that means we need a key card to get me out. One of the personnel, one of the infected ones, tried to get in with a card, but I don't know where he, or where it went. Look, I... I need you, and, well, if you do get me out, I'll give you the biggest hug of your life. Hug? <laughs> Christ! Go no. here, go there, Fetty. I get a hug. Me a bath. <laughs> Typical broad, atypical circumstances. You think fate has anything to do with this? Fate is merely the war cry of those too scared to think for themselves. Okay. <gasps> Blood. Mm, oh, this place is huge! Oh my! Oh my! This seems like fun. All right, should we follow the blood first? I think we shall. More blocked off areas that were just oh, this one's completely blocked off. That weren't really just completely blocked off. No, really, it won't budge. This uh, ambient noise in here, by the way, is delightful. It scares me. <laughs> okay, 
this is the other side of uh, this. Cannot. We're going. Oh, hello. The archaic would never ask that employees work longer than the recommended eight hour shift, but understands that enthusiasm for their work and dedication to the team may often motivate them to do so. Thank you for not letting us down. Gotta go to sleep. Have a good rest. I found another artifact thingy. Yoink. And also there's voices. Might have a week off early November. Nice. More freedom. Oh, I hope I hope that free. I hope so. Have a good rest though. Thanks for hanging out. Thanks. I'll see you next time. Um, I'm gonna find more artifacts. I will find more artifacts and the lore. That delicious, delicious lore. Are we safe? Are we safe? Is this still the to the path of, to the kennel? There's some creepy music in here, and I don't know whether to run away or if it's just part of the music or what. We're going into the kennel. The dogs! I forgot I haven't seen the dogs since the first game. Oh no, there's gonna be dogs in here, huh? No, why did I choose to go into the kennel first? The label <laughs> says the crate contains dog food. I presume this is where the dog slept. It's pretty filthy. <laughs> Can you get into- Ooh, uh, there's another one. Don't mind me, don't mind me. God, what is this? It's it is it. It sounds larger than a creature we've met before. Uh, Ron food and smell of wet dog. It's pretty obvious what this was used for. Yes, well now it's a great hiding spot for us. It'll blend us in very well. Now I'm wondering if those artifact things are like actually pretty common and I just barely picked up any of them. So many more I could have picked up. Why did I choose the kennel? What? What? Dark, isn't it? Oh, you're messing with me again, aren't you? This guy. <laughs> Kinda empty. Now this, this is what it's like to be me, buried deep within the cavernous expanse you call a mind. You see, this is what puts me in such a bad mood. We spend all this time messing about with door codes, levers, human appendages, and it turns out at the blink of an eye, I can just block it all out. Whoosh! Gone. Just you and me on some kind of messed up holiday. You think I can conjure up some margaritas? No? <laughs> Shall we get the hell out of here then? Dude, I don't want you in my head uh, either. It's hardly better, but it, it is more interesting. Just. Oh. Oh, handprints. Oh, those are very small handprints. That's a handprint all over the place. What is going on? Okay. Mm, and there's paw prints on the floor. Okay, let's go this way. Stick to a wall first and then we'll move around. Setter stuff, a couple collars, a leash, and a water bowl. Damn it, flashlight. This flashlight goes by so quickly. Okay, the paws are leading out of this room, so. I don't know. 
Oh no, it's the thing! Judging from the claw and bite marks, I say another dog killed this one. Hopefully. Uh, horrible. Indeed. Where is this sound coming from? It sounds like invents or something. Some, it sounds like a very large creature crawling through the vents, and I'm pretty sure that's what killed the majority of the dogs. Probably not all of them. I knew it wasn't real. I knew it wasn't real. So it didn't scare me as much. Because it wasn't real. Seems like an animal did this, but there's no claw marks. Mm. Mm, what is that spell? Oh, an artifact! I can touch it. <laughs> Circuits and other electric com electric components. Yeah. Open, open, please. I don't know why I'm looking in there, but I think just because I can. Efficiency assessment as sanctioned by Elof Carpenter elevated. Uh, subject Wilbur Frisk, Chief at Overseer Shelter Research Station, Greenland. Report filed by Garrett Quinn. February 20th, 2000. My assessment of Frisk begins today. I have taken up station as his personal assistant and my report will run for six months. Since taking over control of the facility from Brent Stafferson in 1980, Frisk has turned up precious, yeah, precious few results, and I intend to discover why. March 5th, 2000. Having observed Frisk for two weeks, it seems my earlier assumptions may have been quite incorrect. He displays passion, efficiency, and above all, commitment to the cause. These qualities are ably demonstrated by his recent discovery of what is being called the Turin Gate Tomb at the primary excavation. He has, of course, called for a full-scale investigation. April 28th. A small-scale epidemic has resulted from the opening of the tomb. This will be a perfect opportunity to fully observe Frisk's ability to deal with high-pressure scenarios. May 24th. The epidemic has developed beyond all control. There have been many casualties, and it is hard not to highlight Wilbur as the primary cause. Uh, June 13th. Frisk has lost all control. While a number of survivors have fled and others have holed themselves up in the mess hall, Frisk has chosen to lock himself away in the kennels with the remaining dogs for protection. Oh my. I have had no choice but to follow him here in order to complete my report. September? No? I've lost sense of time, but Frisk seems to almost be enjoying himself. He's become very close to the canines. Every day he leaves the compound to forage for food in the main base, which he then feeds to the animals, despite a number of them being infected. October. Ugh. Frisk has developed some strange symptoms. He's become sensitive to light. Ooh. The slightest light scares him away. He's also displaying almost animalistic tendencies. He's been digging out some of the walls and hiding behind them. Further, I suspect he may be sneaking out of the facility at night. Pro possibly even into the mines. Some of the dogs have turned up dead. Entry 8. I have been observing Frisk for some time now, and I believe I conclude my report. Frisk displays outstanding efficiency, though I am now forced to call his judgment into doubt. Despite plenty of rations remaining, I believe he may have begun eating the canines. Entry 9. <laughs> when I woke this morning, there was a corpse lying on the floor beside me. I broke out the flashlight. Fearful Frisk may have been, sav may have been savaged or taken his own life. As I did so, I could not help but see, at the corner of my vision, Frisk fleeing back into the shadows. The dead man was Dr. Roberts, a scientist I was sure had escaped into the mines at the first signs of the epidemic. He had bite marks on, in his side and looked to have been dragged some way. In addition, his tongue was missing. I will continue to observe Frisk while taking additional security precautions. Mm -hmm. A lot of blood on the floor right here. Kept expecting a corpse to pop out. I'm like, oh no. So I did a thing. I just smushed my hand up against the panel. These 
things. They're taking me. They're taking me. They need me. They're beckoning me, beckoning me in. Okay, if I did this, switchboard controlling electricity. I don't know which one's the right one. I've now flicked the thing so many times I have no idea if it's right or wrong. <laughs> that help? I don't know. I hear something eat. Okay, maybe it needs to be on. Because I think the other one's off. Can't open up that one, though. Very quiet and dark, and I don't like this place very much. So I'm guessing he's still around, maybe. Whoa. Oh, jeez! Corpses, you lot must be programmed to just search out danger and throw <laughs> yourselves head first at it. I'm starting to become seriously desensitized here. Duh. Nothing. You're not gonna say anything about the body. Okay, let's move on. Oh yeah, there's something definitely across. It's it's the guy. What's his name? Frisk. I don't think it would be wise to go in there yet. You got it. Thanks, Philip. Try to jot it down a note just in case. Uh, okay. Okay. Now I go flip flip that switch thingy. Gotcha. So has he mutated or has he just gone feral or something? Go. It sounds like something crawling inside the walls. I have a flashlight. Ooh. Where is that coming from? Ah. What? What? Where is that coming from? Able to make it through? Oh gosh. Oh, are you the darkness yourself? Okay, so I, I okay, turn that panel back on. I won't be able to make it through. There's nothing else I can do with that panel. I don't know if it was on before, but I can't turn it off now. Okay, maybe I just need to come back here later. Maybe I don't have enough information. Okay. Because I can't go through that area if if uh, he's just gonna kill me immediately. I can't turn off that panel. So I think I'll come back there. Creepy. No budge. That one's closed up. <laughs> oh. No. No, thank you. Uh, what do I do? What do I do? What do I do? <laughs> Just go into a random door. <laughs> what do I do? Either like you there. Stop. I'm like no. Some notes with strange chemical formulae. Complex medical compounds is not one of my strong points, I'm afraid. Me too. Ooh, what's that? Nitrogen? Hmm. Empty. Empty as well. Empty. Empty. Also empty. The old shelf is in bad shape. Looks like it could collapse at any moment. Well, I don't have a hammer, so I can't break it down like I like to. Mm, 
there's another door here. Doesn't seem to work. I didn't mean to touch it right now, but here we go. These things, they're taking me. They're taking me! You already said that before. Okay. Am I able to move this? I'll throw a chair at it. I can't move the chair. The chair is too heavy for me to move. I can move a barrel or what have you, but I can't move a chair. A desk chair. Who'd have known? Who'd have known that? Desk chairs are too heavy for me. Oh, canine anatomy. Vent. It's great covering. It's a great covering the ventilation shaft. They explode. Various cleaning equipment like soft sp soap, sponges, and, and detergents. Nothing of interest though. No sneaky. Oh. Where do I get that? Tiny boxes? <laughs> I just take these tiny boxes to stand on them. Really? Yup. Excuse me? Bloop. Iodine? Oh, iodine. Quite ordinary and unimpressive landscape painting. Seems a bit out of place. It does, doesn't it? Like, cool. <laughs> That's my solution. I just rip it off the wall. Looks like someone wanted to make sure whatever was on that computer remained a mystery. There's some blood on the floor, too. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Let's just set the chair down right. There we go. I didn't even try the other door. I bet you it's locked. And this is how you get around to the other side. <laughs> yeah, it's blocked! I did it without thinking. <laughs> Go me! Move out the way. Move out the way. Oh, wait. Like, oh. There we go. Although, the door was definitely blocked for a good reason. And here I am, just opening everything. I always think that in, in these horror games, whenever they have like blocked doors, I'm like, it's closed for a reason, it's blocked off for a reason. Maybe it's a better idea if we don't do that. Just saying. You know, all these drugs, there's bound to be a big old needle at the end of this. That'd be enough to put any man off. No shame in that. You don't want to catch anything. One virus is enough for anybody. <laughs> I do have a sir No, my syringe is gone. Oh, I, I use it with that um stuff. That's right. There's blood all over the table. What happened here? Let's not worry about it, you know? Let's just Let's not worry about it for now. Oh! 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 <laughs> Bro mine. Bro mine. <laughs> The body is hooked up to that machine with a set of tubes. What kind of experiments were they doing here? Let's not worry about it. Let's not just, um, take the acetone. What is this? It says, mixture not complete, fail to inject sample. Oh no. Screen reads, awaiting substance insertion, insufficient compounds present. I have to make a thing? Some kind of container? What do I have to make? There's green goo on the floor. I don't think it's a good idea. Anatomy of a human. There are a lot of scribbles around the head area. The only thing read readable is what's a probable entry point with an arrow pointing to the spine. There's like hair or something coming out of the things. Okay, so I have some ingredients. I'm not sure what I'm supposed to do. A way to put stuff into the machine. I have all these chemicals. 
Yeah, chlorine, iodine, nitrogen, acetone, bromine. I don't think I should use any of these just yet, because I don't think... I don't think I have information for this. <laughs> I'm thinking of like the first game where they had the, the, the chemical stuff, but I don't think I have anything for this. I'm gonna come back to it. Is every place here like you come back to it? I swear. At least it's all open now. So I don't have to worry about it. I did come here by accident. I was running away from that enemy. So, you know, it's not so strange. Oh God. What? Been through that door? Sometimes I wish I could just press the the map button and look at a map so I can tell where I've been, but um it's a no go in this game. Okay, have I been? Oh jeez, I don't know where I've been. Okay, this looks like hair coming out of the ground. It's really gross looking. Okay, not the Kennel. Was I in the chemical laboratory in the examination room? Research room? Am I supposed to get a key from this this guy wandering around? I think I am. But I think I need to do something in order to get it. Oh no! No no no! No thank you! No thank you! No thank you! No thank you! <laughs> oh god, this is very dark. Go into the room. What room am I going to? I don't know. I'm just running. I'm panic running. These hallways are not very good to like hide out in. Oh, it auto saved. Am I in a good spot oh, now? Oh damn! There's a gas leak. Guess we won't be getting through today. Let's come back another lifetime, eh? Monkey. Yeah. <laughs> The emergency door. Very sturdy. I have a feeling this door only opens if something's terribly wrong. It'd be super cool if the, um, voice in my head was all like, Wait, there's someone else here! <laughs> Meaning you, like, breaking the fourth wall. That'd be really great. I like it when games do that. They, they're a part of the process. They're taking me, sealing me inside so that, so that the virus can grow. They're partitioning my mind, putting me inside so they can take, so that he can take over. They're imprisoning me. So should I stop touching the machine because I can't help myself? Here we go. This pipe is full of holes leaking gla gas into the room. There must be a way to fix it. Probably. Can't see anything like this though. Jeez, really? Boy, is it really hard? <laughs> Great, another, another lethal gla uh, gas break. Good, oh, good. Could be the gas leak preventing a safety opening. Okay. Look around real quick. Even though I can't see very well, it's very difficult to see. I don't think I have anything for this. No, I can make the hole larger with the saw. How about that? Does that help out? Does that help us? Could this help us? Hmm. Could this help us? Christ, what am I thinking? I'm thinking of trying to repair the stupid pipe. I think that's what I'm thinking. A reinforcing plate to keep the pipe system intact. Not quite right. Come on. Shove the pipe piece on there. <laughs> like, remove this, remove that, and then bloop! Although it could be coming from down here. Start thinking straight. Oops. Some are clearly falling apart. Nope. Okay. That's not it. 
that's just scraps, garbage. How about this? Can we make it worse? That could very well be it, actually. Okay, we gotta make it worse so we can make it better. <laughs> I like this. I like that. I like that a lot. There we go. There we go. Better. What did I say? Make it worse, make it better. Man. Do I have to come back here again? Is it because I need the key card? I did some things. So touch the thing again, even though it's definitely ripping my soul away from me or what have you. I don't know if I should try to run into the guy, see if I can steal the key or something from him. Wish I had a weapon. Okay, that goes back to the kennel. You. No. Not much. What is that noise in the background? It sounds like someone's like... I've already been here! Oh my god, I went in a circle! <laughs> strange about this place. I don't like it. No, oh, I'm trying to open the door. Have it been over here? I'm just trying to go everywhere, really. Budge. Examination room. Okay, I don't think I've been in the examination room. Or have I? Man... Let's try. <laughs> I can't tell. Okay, I've been here. Okay, settle down, flashlight. Have you ever look at this? Some weather newspaper clippings from 1999. They're difficult to read, but some seem to be about some disease spreading around the local population. Yeah, this is... This is with this. I just put random chemicals who made me think they'll go together? I don't know. What if we try putting all the chemicals in there? Seems like a bad idea. Christ, what am I thinking? Not quite right. Nope. Nope. <laughs> I like that Philip's like, I'm not doing that. That's dangerous. And it is. It is dangerous. I'm just trying things because, you know, video game. <laughs> I get it, I get it. We need more information before we can actually make some weird concoction. I understand that. I get it. I do. Earnestly, I do. We need that key card. Point in circles! This is where she's holed up in. I need the key card though. Oh, this there's a circle. Yeah, there's not really many places, so let's keep looking around. Hope for the best. Have you been over here? I have been over here. I remember this. This hair thing. Whatever this is, it's very strange. What is this? Go, oh, you have a weapon. I want it. Can I have that? No. <laughs> Can I have that? Nah, 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 nah. No. Oh, there's two? Oh, God. Oh, 
I've been in here before. I know I have. I can tell. I can tell I've been here before. Well, at least I solved some things. I, I love that I keep doing some stuff, but then I'm never finishing others. <laughs> like the kettles, like this. What was the other place? The, the chemicals, the kennels, the chemicals, and this place. It's because I need a key card. So there's two of them. Can I hit him with a rock? Will that help me? Might try. <laughs> yeah. Ah. No, I crouch. Trying to fight back, it doesn't work very well. I mean, it stuns him for a second, so that's kind of cool. Damn it. Can I go out into the blizzard? Jeez, oh, okay. 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 What? Examination room. Have I been the I feel like I have. I'm going in circles. I am going in circles and it's very annoying. Maybe there's something else I'm missing. Give me any clues. Waiting substance and chemical compound insertion. I'm sure you are. But I don't know what to do. What mixture to concoct. There was one computer. This one, it doesn't seem to work. Okay. Throw a book at this one. <laughs> it is bad stuff. There's also these, but I don't think this is going to help me. Not this place, not this place then. There he is again. I'm going to go back to the kennel maybe? Maybe? I'm not sure where to go. Isn't this where I came from? This is where I came from. <laughs> I went in a giant circle. That's fine. I mean, it's all... connected. I'm, like, looking through the cracks. I'm just... Mm -hmm. can't see in there. <sighs> hey. Don't worry, Amabel. I'm coming for you. But also, can you give me, like, a hint of what I should do? Just a little hint. Just a smidge of a hint. Like, do you want me to fight them? There's only four places. I've been to all of them. So I'm just gonna go to the kennel again. Or something. Should I follow this blood again? I think I stopped following it. Wait, no. Back this way. Oh, it just goes there. Well, that explains it. Can I just go back to the kennel? We can find something. Kennel. Kennel. Okay. Maybe there's something to this one first. The 
chemical one? I have no idea. I don't have enough information. I tried all the chemicals. It was like, nope, you can't do it. So there must be something else. That I'm missing. I could have sworn having my flashlight out would have helped. What if my flares? What if, what if this is where I actually use my flares? <laughs> what if I actually use my flares for this? flares okay so flares don't help me i thought it was like sensitive to light but maybe it has to be like the big bright lights how do i get across then oh i'm back here okay mm. of course it's remotely locked of course it has to be harder <laughs> to get through anything. But of course it does. Okay, so this is the chemical laboratory. So the other one must be the examination room. And then we have the kennel. I'm a little bit at a loss. I don't think I have all these chemicals. No idea what to use them with just yet. I just remember there's, there's supposed to be ten of these. I have eight. Man, that means only two left. Did I miss them? Hmm. It's that place. I can't- there's nothing I can do in here. I already tried. I tried- Throwing all the chemicals into the thing, see what happens, it did nothing. What? What? What indeed? Okay, let's go back to the kennel. See what I can find. There must be a way. <sighs> no, something is not right. But here we are. Hmm. Whoa! Blatant corpses! You lot must be programmed to just search out danger and throw yourselves head first I guess I died right I'm before starting that to become happened. seriously <laughs> desensitized here! Come on, it's a hole in the fence. I could I can easily get through that. Okay, maybe there's something else I'm missing. There must be. There must be something I'm missing here. Some very strange about this place. Oh, I thought that was a statue. I'm like, oh, I missed that one? What? It's in a fence. How do I get to it? I go and what do I do I can't get into this area the paw prints lead right here and then he doesn't say anything about it quick save although it's probably de detrimental to my health Definitely turns off the power. I also hear like this flickering or something going on. So it just makes me wonder if it's like temporary or something. 
Oh, batteries. What do you know? I can't go down this hallway. It's just gonna kill me. I don't know how to get across. Mm, I don't know what else to do. I don't have enough items. So that wards him away so I can cross through this area. But that means I still can't go through the other area. Which I'm pretty sure if I use that panel, it turns it off. Okay, Philip. Taking your word for it. Okay, I need to light up the dark corridor in the kettle somehow. Uh, I need to find the key card so I can enter research room for where Amabel is. There's a remotely locked door in the chemical laboratory. All these things to do, but nothing for me to go on right now. Ooh. I have a bit of a headache coming up. What can I do? I've been in here, right? I think I have. I think I've been to the other side. Maybe. Oh yeah, well I'm gonna make a path anyways. You can easy make it through here. Fine. Ah, that's what I get for trying to make things a little bit easier for me. What was that? There is no How do I fight you? Eh. Where'd you go? I have a jug with your name on it. Oh, oh that didn't do anything. Oof. I want that axe so badly, it is not even funny. So if someone has an axe, the other person has a pickaxe. What could I do? What do I have that'll help out? sure what I can do. I'm at a loss. There's not enough information anywhere. Oh! Sulfur! That that should be the last one. Oh my god. Is this is this what I needed? Do, do I put all of them in here now? Now it's fine for me to put them all in here? Oh, I'm wounded. There you go. There you go, buddy. I'm not trying to combine. I'm just trying to put them there. This seems dangerous. Pour. pour the chemical. 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 All compounds present. Analysis completed. Success. Is this a good idea? I'm something of a chemist myself. That's all it is all over again. Uh, failed injection. Substance insertion. Okay, so I put all the chemicals in there. Now what? Now what do you need? I feel like I may have done something out of order. <laughs> Do you want this? Oh, those eyes. Maybe. 
it's like an umbilical cord, but it's also like a dongle a little bit, but it's higher up. not complete. What else do you need? A flare? Some batteries? <laughs> okay. Well, all the chemicals are out in my inventory. They're in a thing now, but it's still not done. That's just for something later on that I know I don't know what for. I did a thing, so that feels nice. But not what I needed to do. Go there. Oh. Oh, I don't know where to go. Hey, can you help me? Can you help me? Help can Annabelle, can you please help me? to do. Seriously, is this like hair or something? Or is it, it's, it's like either hair or vines, but it looks like hair to me. Just jump up. It's like, I'm done, jump out the, the broken wall window thing. I don't want to be part of this anymore. It's a dumb experiment anyways. Have I been over here? None of these doors will budge. I have been over here. Broken glass and holes, gunfire. I've never seen bullet holes before. <laughs> this is the one with the door that I can't get through? Yeah. Is there an alternate path, maybe? Like, I broke the thing before, can I break something else? <laughs> to make it through. Come on, open. I mean, there's this thingy. I'm feeling this door only opens if something is terribly wrong. I kind of feel like this might be the, the the elevator you go into, maybe at the very end. You know, like it's like, oh no, it's like system activated. All personnel must evacuate immediately. <laughs> Deactivating and releasing all locks. <laughs> That's what I'm thinking. <laughs> Is that? Are the walls alive? Stop that, that's weird. This place is huge. That it is. That it is. There's like something in the walls and it's creepy! Just hide it here. I found a room I haven't been in before. There's two, uh, two chairs and a TV set. Is this where they hang out? <laughs> Nothing is on at the moment. <laughs> I hear them right outside the door. Seen anything in here I can use? Uh, uh, a lot of 
artifact or something. Maybe just make it make it worthwhile. <laughs> Please. Oh, okay, there's nothing in here. Is someone there? No. No one's here. Get into the corner. I'm stuck. I'm stuck a little bit. Okay. Oh, oh no, I am stuck. Oh, okay, there we go. What? Hello. Someone else's choice. Nothing. Someone there. Nothing. All as it should. <laughs> All as it should. Can they not see me in here? That's very odd, but okay. Can't move the chairs are too heavy. Can move this whole thing, but I can't move the chairs. Hi. No. Oh, no fair. I can't see anything. Okay, won't budge. Oh, I'm back in a circle again. This sucks. I don't know where to go. I don't know what to do. I'm lost. I'm lost on what to do. There's the light again. It's going back in a circle again because I can. I'm just, just trying to figure out where I need to go. I'm at a loss. Go back to the kennel, but why? Hello. Something isn't right. <laughs> oh, hello again. Oh my. Okay, so I went in a circle. About to go in another circle again. Okay, just making sure. Most of these doors I can't open. Examination room. Oh, my head hurts. Try to figure this out. My head hurts so bad. Okay. Got the cab I got some sort of progress, I guess. I got the chemicals in the thingy. Chug, but that's not what I need. Can't pick up the bucket, can't pick up that. Or that. Make sure not complete, because I need something else, apparently, but I don't know what. I wonder if that machine is just supposed to help me. Um... Become uninfected. There's something else in here. Did I go through all the places in here? I feel like I did, though. Yeah, it just goes in a circle. It helped me out through the other way. Okay. I have half a mind to check. <laughs> I'm lying to see. I'm like, what do I do? I'm just gonna throw all these books. <laughs> The bounce off of that was great. Okay. Can't go through the kennel. I need lights. And my flare's not doing it, my flashlight's not doing it. To ward off the creature thing. I mean, unless I just run. Should I just try to run? It attacks really fast, though. Yeah, probably. <laughs> I don't care about you anymore. You're a big pain in my butt. 
big old pain. Have you figured? Yeah. That's that's where the elevator is and the door that I can't open because it's remote locked. They just go in a fucking circle again. Good God! Getting tired of this. Okay, kettle. 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 <laughs> yes, down this hallway. Jeez. I'm gonna try to run past the the frisk. I'm guessing it's a mutated version of frisk or something. I don't think it'll work though. Just saying. But worth a shot because I don't know what else to do. Turn it off. Touch the thing again. Ah! Frightening! It's not helping me! It's like, what is that noise? Okay, let's see if I can run across. Ready? Then run! No fair! There's like two bites and I'm dead. Is that my fucking thing out? I can't open this. It won't let me. And I tried to sneak as well. Sneaking didn't work. There must be something. Um, can I take you with me? No, you're not even a lantern. <laughs> Can't set it to like a timer so it can turn off once I leave this area. Only. Okay, reinvestigate everywhere. Look around, look for things. See if there's anything I missed. Uh, no, no, like, fire I can light. There's this body. This looks dangerous. The holes in the walls. Oh, I can hear them eat. It stinks. Hmm. What can I? I don't even see the creature whenever he shows up. I don't even see Frisk. <laughs> if that is actually him, I don't see him at all. I'm going to I'm going to give in. I'm going to give in and look up where I need to go. Like what 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 do I need to do? What can I what am I what am I missing? Oh. Oh, I think I just saw it. I think I just saw it and this is actually something I thought, but I wasn't sure if it was going to work because 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 I didn't think it was going to work. 
I didn't think it was gonna work, but here we go. Okay, 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 I'll do it. I'll do this. I'll, I'll, I read it very briefly. It was like a forum. <laughs> I read it very briefly. Um, so I think this will work. You gotta block the holes. And I thought about this, but I didn't try. So that's on me. I didn't see if this is the actual solution for this. So, as I said, I just read it briefly, but like, oh, wait, that's an idea? Let's do it, let's roll with it. Just, excuse you, mouse. I mean, it's very curious to have these big, heavy blocks, like, way over there. made it go in a diamond shape and I couldn't push it out the room. Of course, of course. <laughs> I didn't want to spoil anything else for myself. It's an old game, so I'm pretty sure spoilers are abound everywhere. So we're not gonna let that happen. We're just gonna like briefly like what should I do? It's like, oh block the hole. It's like okay. Let's not let's not ruin ruin this for myself. Okay, okay. Bloop. Hopefully this works. Oops. Back to my glow stick. All right. Nice. That's all I needed to do. Happy about that. Good. It, sh it should have been so obvious to me. <laughs> Honestly. Whoa! Wait, how come this- Uh, duh, oh. What? Did the lights turn back off or something? I'll go test. They look like they're off in this hallway. to go over here oh I see now that's why I kept hearing that sound the lights coming on oh there's a lot of holes in here Go, let's just close the door behind me. Hello, sir. His body's covered with bite marks and scratches. Key cards? I hate key cards. Whatever <laughs> happened to good old bullshit padlocks? That's what I want to know. D Aren't you like some weird otherworldly entity? Why do you care about any, any key cards, padlocks, or anything? Like, why would you care anything at all about that? Research room. Oh, finally, finally, finally. Getting somewhere. Good God. I need to wait for the lights to come back on. Was there another room, by the way? I don't think there is. Get out of here, I'm so tired of this area. <laughs> okay. Kennel, done. Throw that out of here. Seriously, all I needed was that little bit. It's like, hey, block the holes. <gasps> uh, duh, oh my. So, wanna let her rot a few more hours, make her really appreciate this daring rescue attempt, or shall we go let her out now? Make the most of her while she's vulnerable, huh? Nudge, nudge, wink, wink, eh? You do better stay <laughs> Whee! My dear entity in my head, where have you? Uh, yeah. 
there. <laughs> Where have you got these really perverted notions? Was it my own head? Did you get that from me? It's not acceptable. It's not right, man. It's not right. Shelter Research Station is encountering technical difficulties. <laughs> Please have your personal cyanide capsule at the ready. Oh, photos of the research team, very distinguished. No. And the doggos. And a family. And where is she, by the way? Don't tell me I have to kill her like I had to kill Red. I'm gonna lose all my friends. <laughs> Various sketches of animals, spiders, worms, dogs, fish, and more. Probably some part of some kind of study. projector screen. I don't see a projector around here, though. <laughs> Just wanted to clean up the place a little bit. It's locked. A small sign explains that this is Dr. Swanson's office. Where? What small sign? I don't see a small sign. It's an old drinks machine. Seems to be broken. Batteries? I'm not gonna touch that just yet. Calendar from last year. Oh, no, I'm not done snooping around. I'm sure you're behind that door. <laughs> Ooh, what's that? Pills? Gimme. There we go. Lengthy medical texts. I don't. I really don't have the time to read them, much less understand them. Statues, or that I missed the two. <gasps> it's a baby! <laughs> I can't pick it up. <laughs> I want to pick it up. Okay. You're not going to get picked up then. You're just going to get thrown to the floor. <laughs> Hold on, I need to take a shit. I'll be right back. <laughs> There's a thin layer of some stray substance in the sink. Better keep my hands off. You. <gasps> toilet paper. Put it right into the toilet. What have we done? It's written in blood. Desperation's not uncommon down here. I mean, yeah. I'd rather not use the toilet here. Well, then let's just put some toilet paper in there. Not looking healthy. What's not looking healthy? Me? Probably not. Or the 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 splooch on the floor. I'm guessing. All right, I'm here. I'm here to talk to you. Hello. Where are you? Oh, don't tell me you're already dead. Don't. Where are you? Stop playing this game with me. Uh. Mm. Annabelle. Oh, looky here! More perilous, death-defying action, courtesy of the skinny English professor. Yes. Why not? Try running towards him, screaming for a change. No. No. Uh, um. 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 Uh. Ah. Ah. No, uh, um, no, uh, brain. No, da, da. Uh, come on. Uh, uh, the other brain. Mind holding this. Okay. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't know what that does. No, no, box. <laughs> Specimens are better dead. Uh, 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 wait. Uh, uh. 
I was thinking Skyrim. Put a thing on, up. Uh, 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 oh, you broke my door. Oh, man. Uh, wormy. Uh, uh, specimens. Oh, gods. Ah! Uh, what do you want me to do? Okay, it's up. You happy now? The thing is up. What? Not up all the way? Ah. 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 Have a door. Oh. I didn't do anything. Ah. I don't know what to do. What should I do actually? I'm a bit stunned. Have whatever this is. I'm just breaking all these stuff. Specimens. <laughs> um, um. Not nice in the slightest. Nothing is here. How to deal with that thing? Ah. Yeah. Please, there's no way I'd ever get it open. I don't know what to do. I lifted the thing, but it did nothing. Mm. Give me a little bit more time to think, okay? A little bit more time. Have another specimen on the house. You're welcome. <laughs> Come on. Yeah. Um. I'm sorry, I can't open this other one with the specimens in it. Busy trying to figure out what to do. Hello, can't lock you anywhere. I see. Uh, uh, um, uh, I see the wormy thingy again. What about this box? What about this box? What about this box? What if I put it here? Uh, go away. Shoo! <laughs> Amabel. Is this Amabel actually? She's been lying to me this entire time. Why do I feel like that? That's true. Oh, well, now that I have a moment to breathe, let's see. There's boxes everywhere. This I can raise and lower. This thingy. Can you get bored already? <laughs> I'm not seeing anything that I can do. I mean, if I could change this out to a different one, maybe. I have one more specimen to throw away at you, and bloop. Just making sure. <laughs> I'm like, I can't switch these out. Huh? What does this do? I have no idea. Stop it. Not quite right. All right. Um, I don't have any more specimens over here, so I may have to die once just so I can figure out what I need. It's okay. Oh, I, so I can't move that thing?
Can't move that. Can't move that. Can I jump to that from here? Nope. <laughs> That's my answer. Okay. So I was thinking it could raise and then lower and this knocks on him or breaks that out from underneath. I don't think it's heavy enough. I'm losing blood, but I should be okay. Go ahead, heal up again. Why not? I'm just sit up here, popping pills, waiting for the inevitable end. Like, hmm. Can we talk this through? I don't think diplomacy is here. trying to type it just right. I'm like, I'm gonna keep trying this. Hey, good work, buddy. Give yourself a slap on the back with a crowbar, why don't you? I had a feeling. Oh, uh, one thing, <laughs> before you get too overwhelmed with glee, I know murder can be a lot of fun, but uh, didn't you quite like that broad? Hey, I, knew it. I think that's a piece of her skull in your shoe. Wait, don't tell me you really thought... <laughs> I thought you knew I was pulling your leg. Oh, I knew, but I don't think <laughs> Philip knew. Oh, my best laid plans and all that. <gasps> this, th this is just terrible. You silly Billy. Come on, monkey. Take a joke. Mm. I knew it. I knew you were lying to me. If the labels are correct, you seem to be originate from Alaska. <sighs> that was really difficult to get to this point. I knew it. I knew he was lying to me, man. I'm sorry, Amabel. A key. <laughs> dot, dot, dot. He says why, it. It's some sadness. Oh, why are they always holding a key? Or a note? Or a swipe card? Why is it never, I don't know, a, a cheese sandwich? I'm starving. You say nothing about... That's fair. I can't. Oh, poor Philip. Uh, so we're boxes on the shelf. Some of them are labeled specimen number 21, Lake Utu Utak. I wonder what they found in those waters. I'm glad I kept out of it. I had a feeling. I had a feeling. Something about this seemed wrong. I'm like, either Amabel was lying to me this entire time, or once again the voice in my head is messing with me. Judging from labels, they seem to contain various findings. Well, now I can read instead of panicking running around. There's no way I'd ever get it open. So she tried to help me out, and she's just like, what are you doing? Stop throwing stuff at me. Oh no, you're infected. <laughs> I think that's what it was. Huh. Oh, cool. Batteries. Oh yeah, what kind of key did I get? Um... Swanson's key. Oh yeah, there's a room that's locked, isn't there? This one. You need to get this creature out of your head, man. <laughs> Rusty metal shelf. The rate at which everything has here has decomposed is quite astonishing. I guess it's all the moist, but I, I guess it's all the moist. But still. <laughs> it was a very strange sentence. Okay. 
Okay. Ooh. Oh, nothing. <laughs> okay, my bad. I guess it's nothing. batteries for me. Let's turn Boring. on this computer. Where's the games on this <laughs> thing? Okay. Antidote. Cure. Amabel Swanson. If you're reading this, I guess you won't have to put up with me anymore. I know you will have tried your best, so I suppose thanks for giving me that, at least. I thought I'd knock something up to help you, just in case I wasn't around to do it myself. Sorry, it's a bit formal force of habit, I guess. Abstract. The purpose of this procedure is to formulate a cure that will stabilize the infection in the host and, if possible, reject it entirely. Experiments have shown that injections covering as much as 50% of brain tissue can be reversed uh, at an 80% success rate. In rare cases, the mixture will destroy both host and infection. Ah, the luxury of having no choice. Compound mixture type ZX3 version 2 built from substance analyzer. Acetone, chemical base, chlorine, catalyst, sulfur, delivery packet, iodine, stabilizer, nitrogen, pH balancing, bromine. Acidity regulator. Fairly important. Without this, it'd just be a big old rat poison. Ke chemicals will automatically be stored in the order listed above. The most important addition is substance 65. I've only had access to 12 and 67, which has proven to work with varying degrees of success. 65 has similar though exaggerated properties to 67 and was discovered just before infection, so it should still be quarantined within the chemical labs. Method. All chemicals should be combined within the ZX3 version 2 and stored according to listed order. At default settings, the storing will be automatic and chemicals can be poured into the machine in any order. Good thing I did that without reading anything. <laughs> Substance is to be inserted into container slot. It's vital that the chemicals are mixed in the following order, chlorine, acetone, iodine, bromine, nitrogen, and finally sulfur. Note that due to an error during manufacturing, the lower button row got reverse numbering, making the rightmost start at four and then increasing to the left. After successful mixture, the host can be injected with up to three milligrams, depending on the severity of infection. Should I take a picture of that one though? Of the order that they should be mixed. I feel like I might. I mean, you might write it down too, but just in case. Just in case. Just in case. Um, since the viral aspect of the host mind is likely to be weakened or inflicted portion of the original host identity, the final state of the host is in, in clear. I guess I'll never give up on the fairy tale ending. It's also likely that some remnant of the viral capabilities may remain, telepathy, memory, perhaps even the ability to communicate with the central nervous system. Seriously though, even if we didn't quite get her happily ever after, thanks for trying, it meant a lot to me. This broad, we, uh, sorry, you, kill her <laughs> off. And she's still jetting a lot of piss and wind from beyond the grave. That's about as likely to work as aromatherapy is to cure cancer. Here's a diagram. Oh god, it's the shelter population graph. Diagram two. Animal mutation rate. Whoop. Uh, diagnostics. Initiate general status. Fact facility condition critical. Transportation inaccessible. Chances of survival 78%. Error recalculating 78%. Oh, 78. 0.00% recalculating 0.78% experimental status subjects chimpanzee 3 lab rat 12 human 3 condition unknown visitor thoroughput last new visitor 1 year 2 days ago last confirmed exit 8 days ago total exits last year 31 total exits this year 3 total visitors this year 1 Operational systems. Life support, 36%. Catering offline, transport offline, communications. Internal only, security offline, plumbing, 100%. No further information available. Major events. Please wait. 21st August 1972, accident 18C occurs. 1st April, 73, construction starts. 3rd of March, 75, construction complete. 6th of January, 1992, Substance 63 and Artifact 66B discovered at Site B. 
27th April 2000, investigation of tomb. 35 logs corrupted and could not be recovered. Oh my. Current research projects. Project uh, C-567 status completed. Outcome negative. Project A-163 status completed. Outcome negative. Project R-212 status ongoing. Outcome unknown. Okay. I don't have a password for this one. Unlock. Chem airlock. Oh, it's the one door. Okay. What's this one, though? Shmup. <laughs> um. Hmm. Do I have. I don't think I have that, do I? I don't know what that could be. Let's see my notes real quick. Okay, so I open up that door, chemical laboratory. Need to find substance 65. I could have sworn I was gonna end up going to um, the tomb. Maybe I will. No idea. Oh yeah, I wrote it all down. That's good. Is there no password changes? Could it be any of these? I don't think so. It looks like it's something completely different. I don't know what that is. Oh well. Well, this is a sad end for Amabel, my 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 new friend that I instantly lost. <laughs> oh well.